Hey guys, welcome back to another Swift tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you guys how to use a long press gesture recognizer. So the long press one is quite different as you can actually recognize when it's running and when it's finished. So uh, you can actually do this with some other ones but uh, I'm just going to highlight it in this. So I'll show you how to customize it, how to make it uh, work for you and things like that. So yeah. Um, so what we're going to do first is I'll add an image view and just be like our indicator. So let me just give it some constraints, height and width. And also in the center like that, give it a, um, give it a outlet. So I'll just call this image view. And then when the view loads, uh, I'll just set image view, uh, image view dot background color is equal to let's do dot red at starting so uh, here now what we can do is we can create our gesture recognizer so let long press gesture is equal to ui long long press gesture recognizer target is ourself and action we just create a uh, um, objective c function which we'll just call um, long pressed and gesture recognizer how do I use oh recognizer um, this is a UI long press gesture recognizer I don't know if I spelt that right let me just copy and paste this <laughs> so recognize uh so yeah and then we can just set this as that uh, long press oh actually it needs to be hashtag selector long press okay and now uh, we can actually start customizing it so the few things we can do is we can do long press gesture dot um, minimum press duration uh, and this is just how long you have to hold it so most of the time we can just set this to let's say let's just say one second and we also have to set the delegate to self so long press just recognize it dot delegate equal to self uh, I think that might uh, let me just add in the missing things uh, yeah that should work and finally we just need to add it to the view so self dot view dot add gesture um, and then this is just a long press gesture so yeah now in here let's just first let's just print oh why did I use it long press and let's just test this first and then I can show you guys how to differentiate if it's running or if it's finished uh, yep. so I think this should apply to the whole view so let me just hold it and yeah it says long pressed so yeah uh, you could also stop it from um, doing it multiple times by just having it activate something when it's done it once and then it stops but that's another time so now what you can do is you can do if gesture recognizer dot state is um, not equal to UI gesture recognizer dot state dot ended so if it's not ended this means it has it's still running uh, so here I can set the image view oh, image view dot background color I can set this to orange and now if it's else that means that has ended which means I can set this to green so it's like red orange green uh, background color equal to dot green so let's just do this now and let's see if it works so I hold it and then I let go and it's green so yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in a future tutorial, uh, if you just hold it and let go. So yeah, see you guys in a future tutorial, bye.